Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video. I am currently in Dinuba. I'm waiting to get a call for a door. Um, in this video, guys, I am going to bring you guys with me maybe for today, uh, which is Friday, tomorrow, Saturday. Um, I got like four pickups here in Dinuba, Delano, and Yuma, and San Luis, Arizona. So then after that, guys, this load is going to Houston, Texas. Um, it's going to Houston Avocado. But I've been having kind of problems with this load because yesterday I came, the product wasn't ready with the customers. So today, I guess today is the day. We shall see. But let's go eat something real quick. I did go to Doghouse, so let's eat on that salad. opened up. a dog guys but I want to show you guys my new semi truck it is right here behind me this is my new Kenworth T680 it is a 2020 I mean 2017 um, yeah you guys can see uh, we just got it uh, this is gonna be my new semi and maybe in a couple videos it is automatic I'm barely getting used to, to the automatic semi truck i did drive a 10 speed before but i mean i'm getting used to it so so far it's going so good i don't know how, how to feel about it yet i love it though the things i do want to do to it is i want to put some custom led lights right here and then probably put a watermelon right here put a watermelon right there the only thing i put put yet was the uber sign <laughs> But yeah guys i did not buy this truck off the lot or nothing it's it's a used semi truck it did come with some with little details um like for example this thing right here it came like that the old driver these these are bent in they're both bent in on that side and this side i mean it's it's a good truck though it's brand new for me it's a 2017 it, I love it, I love it. This is the front right here. Fire truck, fire truck. Like
like I said right here. These came like bent in when the driver was doing like his U turn. I didn't bend them. Kind of like bent these. Guys, I just finished loading here in Dinuba. Um, they took a really long time, but it's all right. I am now heading to Yuma, Arizona, and then I gotta drive a couple like 20 uh, 20 miles down to San Luis. So I got a couple like eight hours ahead of me. Um, I am going to pump some fuel right now just to make it there. Still getting used to the automatic so yeah guys it's kind of confusing when you don't have a clutch anymore and you got to get used to this sign <laughs> on my new Kenworth. I just cleaned it yesterday here on Manning and 99. So it looks really shiny everything. Like I said, I wanted to add the LED. Well, I already bought the LED stripe. So it's going to go right here. And then add the watermelons right here. The one right there. And then the inside. Maybe add some in the inside. Cause I only got that one right there on the bottom, so time con el tiempo va a ser todo. It takes time.
let's go to Yuma all the way from Delano to Yuma guys hey guys welcome back to the next day of this video I am right now and I slept in Yuma but I drove here to San Luis it's right across the border from San Luis Rio Colorado Sonora um, they just gave me a door I still got to go back to Yuma and load so they just gave me door 7 so let's go look guys that's the wall right there San Luis Rio Colorado Sonora this is where the dock is at guys I came you could kind of see Mexico not really but that's San Luis Rio Colorado Sonora that's crazy this is the the wall and then that's my truck right there isn't it just crazy how on this side of the US this wall separates us I don't know it's pretty crazy to me like it's a whole different world over there they just finished they closed here in San Luis at 2 and then the other one in Yuma the company closed at 6 
and I already know they're gonna take a long time because it's two pallets here and a Yuma it's 11 so now I'm going to Yuma which is 30 minutes away not that far let's check out now let's leave yeah let me stop gracias going to the scale we're gonna weigh ourselves real quick before we head out because I am pretty heavy it's good right there Texas from Yuma all the way to Houston guys let's go 